You see a masterpiece. We see a graveyard. The Brooklyn Bridge is a marvel of steel, but its true foundation lies on the broken bodies of its first builders. To sink the two main towers, engineers had to use huge, pressurized underwater wooden boxes called caissons. Workers, mostly poor immigrants, descended into these boxes hundreds of feet beneath the East River to dig through the riverbed. The pressure was crushing. Many returned to the surface paralyzed, crippled, or in agonizing pain from a mysterious new affliction, caisson disease, or the bends. The workers called it the gripes, a searing agony in the joints that only pressure could ease. Over 100 men were severely injured, and at least 20 died, literally collapsing while digging the bridge's massive foundation. Even the chief engineer, Washington Roebling, was crippled by the bends, forcing him to supervise the rest of the 13-year project through a telescope from his window. The Brooklyn Bridge isn't just a landmark. It's a silent, breathtaking monument to the human cost of engineering progress.